Hello everyone, I'm your brother in Christ, Hosanna David. I bring greetings to you in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Thank you for watching. Thank you for those of you who have been sharing my videos. May the Lord bless you in Jesus' name. In case you are new, please do subscribe before you leave. Ego Eye Opener. You can also subscribe to my other YouTube channel, BS Purity TV, Biblical Sexual Purity Channel. I want to talk about Jesus' promise about the rapture. Some people actually think that the rapture was invented in the 18th century. But is it actually in the Bible? We will look at that another day. But today we want to talk about his promises, Jesus talking expressly about the rapture in the Bible. I want to read Luke chapter 21 verse 36. Jesus said, Watch ye therefore and pray always that ye may be accounted worthy to escape all these things that shall come to pass and to stand before the Son of Man. Jesus was talking about the distress of nations, the end time wars that will definitely come upon the world. And he said, we should watch and pray so that we can be accounted worthy to escape all these things and to stand before the Son of Man. In John chapter 14, one following, John 14, one following, I want to read what Jesus actually said here. He said, let not your hearts be troubled. Believe in God, believe also in me. In my Father's house, there are many mansions. If it were not so, I would have told you, I go to prepare a place for you. And if I go and prepare a place for you, I will come again and receive you unto myself, that where I am, there ye may also be. This is Jesus' promise himself. The rapture is an escape. It is a time, an event that Jesus will come to receive his beloved children to himself. The dead will also rise too. But those who are living, who are alive, will be changed within a twinkle of an eye. And they will rapture and meet Jesus in the air. They are going to rapture. Jesus will not touch the earth. He is not going to touch the earth, but he will be above in the sky and the, the Christians will rapture and meet him, including the dead in Christ who will rise first. Jesus said that he is going to prepare a place for us. And after preparing the place, what will happen? He would come to receive the church to himself. Not just church goers, not just anybody that attends church, but those who watch and keep their garments white. Those who watch and pray and keep their garments white. Those who remain in the vine, the branches that remain in the vine, will be raptured to be with the Lord. The rapture is never an invented event. It will definitely take place. The message I want to give to us this morning is that as you look at the world and see different kind of things happening and increasingly they are increasing every day, different kind of bad news wars everywhere. They are increasing every now and then. The Lord is going to come to deliver us. It may be this generation, it may be the next, it may be another generation, but definitely before the world gets worse. I am not saying it's going to be the specific time. Nobody knows when the rapture is going to take place, but Jesus Christ is definitely going to come. I am making this video to tell people that the rapture is real and it is going to take place. The Bible says that Jesus Christ will return again. This is Jesus' own word that he is going to return to take us to himself. And we will escape the evil that will come. 
That means as a time, the reign of the Antichrist, when people shall be forced to do what they don't want to do. That time must surely come. Every preparation is in place. The government is ready. The financial system is ready. The, the, the uh, economy is ready. The, the world is totally ready for the operation of the Antichrist. Let us watch because the time is near. Thank you and God bless you. Bye-bye.